Hello everyone, this is JW Vincent, and welcome back to our Let's Play of Final Fantasy II. I'm sitting today. I apologize for the glare on my glasses. I cannot get rid of it. I've tried, and I've tried, and I've tried, and I just cannot do away with it. Let me tell you what I did off camera real quick. Well, first of all, what I did off camera was I did not sleep last night. I got probably an hour of sleep, so I'm hyped up on coffee. I don't know how long it'll last. Probably not very long at all. I have built up like a tolerance for caffeine. It's terrible. It's absolutely awful. But, that's not what I wanted to tell you about me doing, actually. What was actually important that I note that we did was, after I died in Deist Cavern last, last episode, as you'll recall happened, I did, I did die in Deist Cavern. I went out to Bavsk. I went over to Bavsk. And I decided to grind in Bavsk. It was important to me that we grind in Bavsk. It's also important to me that I emphasize the k at the end of Bavsk. Okay? So, take note of it. Um... But it was important to me that I grind near Bosk so I'd have access to an inn. You can't grind near, uh, Deist Cavern. You can't grind near Deist Cavern because it doesn't have an inn. Or Deist. Not Deist Cavern, but Deist itself. But, behold, Deist is right here. Bosk is here. Well, no, Bosk is here. Deist is right here. That's it. That's the whole of it. I was that close the whole time. Anyway, um, yeah, guys, I'm having I'm having a bit of a day. I uh, I've had three, maybe four cups of coffee, um, in an attempt to energize myself for this this video, and that's why I'm sitting too. I'm sitting because I need to conserve energy so I can put it into the video instead of into bouncing back and forth, which I do often. Actually, I'm sitting just because I don't care for the way that I bounce back and forth all the time. We're going to head over to Deist Cavern. We're going to see if we can't get that uh, uh, Wind Drake amulet that we're supposed to be collecting. I'll go ahead and, I'll go ahead and admit, admit to you guys, my grinding, my method for grinding is to... Um, it is find a group of enemies. It doesn't matter how many enemies show up. Just find a group of enemies. Kill all but one of them. This is pretty standard grinding technique, mind you. And then cast shield on my entire group. Shield on everyone. And then cast uh, shell on everyone. All the while, Therian should be casting fire one on the entire team. Maria will be casting blind on the entire team. Layla will be casting bolt on the entire team. And Gus is, you know, Shielding and shelling and ooh, a mithril mace. Look at that. We got a piece of garbage. We got a piece of garbage, guys. Yay! Pieces of garbage. Yay! <laughs> um, he'll be shelling and shielding and healing and blinking, um, in an attempt to raise the level of shield and shell and blink. Which, by the way, have not gone up a level. Neither has a uh, blind. I thought I thought for sure that I would have leveled up blind by now, but no. Blind remains a level 1 spell. It's sad. It's terrible. I use it a lot, too. I don't understand how it happens. I never looked up what slivers were. I meant to. I meant to come back into this video last night at around 3 a.m. I was grinding, and I was like, I should Google where slivers come from originally. And then I didn't. After that, I didn't. They certainly favor the, uh... Guys, I have a cell phone. They certainly favor the slivers from Magic the Gathering. Like, there's no doubt, there's no doubt that they look like, ooh, a blind scroll. They don't look like a blind scroll. They don't look like, ooh, a blind scroll either. There's no doubt that they favor, ah, I don't want to turn on my location. Why does Google always want my location information? Even for things like, you're Googling sliver, you better turn on your location. Shadow, Wraith, Ghoul, and Ghast. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll just hit him. Okay. Uh, Sliver, 1993 Thriller Romance. It's not what I'm looking for. Huh, interesting. Okay, that, that wasn't what I was looking for, though. Uh, Sliver Pizzeria in Berkeley, California. I need to be more specific. 
Sliver Fantasy Not Marble Creature Fantasy Marble? What is that? What is that? Anyway, Sliver Oh, look! Behold, a Sliver Can you see it? I'm trying to Oh, look at that! Isn't that a nice picture of a Sliver right there? See? You, you don't get these kinds of things without watching my videos you definitely couldn't Google Sliver yourself and look at the first image that came up on Google. Slivers are creatures that share a hive mind, which allows them to share their abilities with other nearby slivers. The creature type was introduced in Tempest. Okay, so when did Tempest come out? Tempest was released in October 1997. So, yeah. Um... Magic introduced slivers after uh... after Dragon Ball Z after Final Fantasy. <laughs> I was playing the uh so I I came to own through a series of events where I made a mistake. I came to own um, a dragon, a dragoon's corpse lies on the ground. Something shines beside it. It's a dragoon's pendant. Oh, well, that was easy. That was decidedly simple. No, not silver. Sliver. Definitely sliver. Okay. Sliver fantasy creature origins? I feel like, I feel like I'm in a, uh, if Google was a person video. You know those videos? If Google was a person? Can I stun it? I don't want to holy it. Let's just attack it. Yeah. Oh. Oh, okay. Ah! Okay. What is, what is going on with Gus? Why does he hit for so much damage? Cannot stun. Did sleep though. Oh, can I blind it? That would be useful. That would be infinitely useful. Ah, shoot. Sliver creature origins. Mythical creatures. Black, silver, and gold edition. No, not what we're looking for. Recoculus. Uh uh. Silver has mystic powers, TV trope. Cobalt. Cobalt came up, guys. Cobalt? You know, cobalts. The things that are just like slivers in every way. Uh, Wendigo, the mythical creature. Why is it silver that kills a werewolf? Because silver is a purifying element. It purifies the soul. I don't know for a fact that that's the explanation that they go with, but that's what I've always understood it as. Um, silver, oh, Sliver Queen. That one is Sliver, but it's Again, it's Magic the Gathering, which makes me wonder if it's a Final Fantasy original. Now, when did Final Fantasy II come out? FF2 release. It's got to be, like, ancient. No, not FF7, which, by the way, released January 1997, I think. Ironically, it would have come out possibly before Slivers as well. Huh. Who would have guessed? Alright. Final Fantasy II came out December 17th, 1988. They had a whole nine years on Magic the Gathering as far as the release of Slivers. So, Sliver... What if we type in Sliver D&D? &D? You, think, you think that might produce something? You think we might get something on Sliver for D&D? &D? Maybe. Sliver, 5th edition race. Well, that makes sense. Sliver... 3.5 edition race. Okay, I, I can see that. 3.5, when is that? Late 90s, right? So that would that would make sense to have come from... Why can't I go in? There we go. 5th edition, homebrew, slivers, sliver, monsters, homebrew, D&D. &D. Mm, 3.5 slivers, yes, again. Giant in the playground, that... that 5th edition, homebrew, slivers. These all seem to be newer than, uh, again, newer than 1988. 
I don't even know when the first D&D came out. Guys, we're history diving today. Can I just talk to it, or do I have to show it the item? Okay, he's just going to talk to it. Come with us. Let's fight together. The poison has already affected my entire body. I am dying. No! <clears throat> kind sirs, please hear my final wish. Please take this egg to the cave north of this castle and place it in the spring there. This is the last dragon egg. If it is not placed in the sacred spring, it will wither and die. I'm going to save a species, guys! I'm like one of those activists. I'm an activist, guys. I've become an activist. That's the name of the episode. I'm an activist. Hi. Excuse me, ma'am. The cavern is said to have a spawning ground of the Windrakes called the Sacred Spring. Oh, you don't say. Hey, did he die? Please take that egg to the spring. Rawr! Oh! I killed him! Oh, no! I'm a terrible activist! I'm a monster! New name of the episode, guys! I'm a monster! <laughs> Oh, that's so sad. Well, so will it, will it hatch, like, immediately? Do I get the egg? Do I get... Is a drake gonna join my party? Is this Shining Force now? That's a game I want to play. <gasps> I own it on PC. I could play it. I could play Shining Force. God. Ow! Sorry. I had a moment. I need to save before I go into this cave, too. Very important that I save before I go into this cave. Oh! I could play Shining Force. I love Shining Force. Do you love Shining Force? If you love Shining Force... Leave a comment down below. Yeah. Yeah. And don't forget to smash that subscribe button. And punch the like button in the face. Something Jack Spadicey. Yeah. That's what I'm going with. So I wear the cap. So you confuse me with the Irish guy. It's a totally different cap. Totally different. 100%. You know, I got a bit of Irish in me. It only shows through when I'm drinking, though. Who would have guessed? Okay, we need to save before we go in here. <laughs> I'm about to barge right in there and die. And have to start over again. Um, fortunately, I saved after grinding. I don't, know, I don't know if I started recording before I actually got into the game. But I saved after grinding. So, I shouldn't have to grind again. I think this is doable. I don't think I really needed to grind last time. I just needed to not be an idiot during those... Uh, Hill giant fights. I keep wanting to hit R1 to retreat. Do you know why I want to hit R1 to retreat? Let me tell you why. I'm playing Breath of Fire 3 over on the year in gaming. You should go check it out. It's right down there at the bottom of my, uh, like if you look below my face, you'll see Tekken 3. And then below that, you'll see Breath of Fire 3. And that's the game I'm playing currently on the year in gaming. It's only got today's episode and tomorrow's episode. I should have recorded today's episode right now. Because by the time I finish this, it will be too late to get an hour of Breath of Fire 3 in. I should have just made this video late. Now, both videos are going to be late, and it's going to be my fault. It's going to be my fault! It's okay, though, guys. I don't remember how long we record. I don't know if it's a 20-minute episode or a 30-minute episode. But I'm going to tell you this. I set up an outro capture so that I can just swap over to that. Guys, I have completely eliminated Adobe Premiere. As long as I don't do something stupid... I've completely eliminated editing from my schedule. It's just perfection. It's it's me. It's me, right? It's me. I'm recording, right? I record and then I'm done. That's it. All right. All right. This is what this is what I kept forgetting to do. I can shield my team. I don't know. I don't know if I should have him shield everyone because if he only shields maria as a result then i've lost that shield because maria won't be affected okay he shielded layla instead with any luck it won't matter i don't know if it can be blinded i'm gonna keep trying to blind it though is blink a higher level than shield no okay uh go ahead and shield yourself if you die, we're screwed, as I've proved before. Proven, as I have proven before. Guys, I'm going to Google if Hill Gigas is susceptible to blind. Hi. How can I help you, Google asks. Oh, no. Oh, no. Stop talking, Google, please. You didn't hear that. That See, 
now I have to edit this video, but I'm not going to. Uh-uh. Uh, that ain't me, guys. Okay, I'm just going to attack it for now, because I don't know if... Again, I don't know if it's susceptible to blind. Kill Gigas, FF2. Sliver Fantasy Creature, cre creature Hill Gigas, Final Fantasy 2. Thank you. No, I just want to know about the Hill Gigas, really. Hey, we got a Titan's Helm. Look at that. Sweet. Sweet. Let's equip that. Let's equip that right now. What's it do, anyway? I don't know what it does. Uh, Gus, you're not wearing a Titan's Helm. What's it do? Helm with the power of a Titan. Oh, it increases his attack and his defense. Hang on. You're wearing one, okay. Yeah, you equip that, son. And, uh, can you... That would actually decrease your defense. Okay. Gold gold hairpin is better than Mithril Helm. Good to know. Okay, let's go this way. Go this way. <clears throat> Excuse me. Guys, I should be I should be struggling to get these treasure chests, but I'm not going to. Oh man. It looks entirely different in some of this art. Oh, there are two of them. That means I need to cast sleep on the back one. And have Furion attack the front one. And I need to cast shield on the party. And hope it succeeds. That's what we're running with right now, boyos. Misa gonna win. The Hill Gigas, also known as the Gigas and the Giant, is an optional boss. And later, enemy in Final Fantasy II. Layla's dead, guys. I'm sure you all saw that already. Neither of them stayed asleep for a full turn. I'm sure you saw that already as well. Shield yourself, Gus. Screw Firion. Shield yourself. <laughs> oh, no! Did it even work? Okay, okay, he's, he's shining now. All right. You need to sleep both of those. You need to bring Firion back to life right now. Actually... You probably should have cast Blink on yourself now that I think about it. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's okay. If they go to sleep... Did I say we were recording for 30 minutes? If I die here, we're recording for 20 minutes. <clears throat> I need to slow down so that, uh, so that I don't die instantly. 18 minutes, guys! We've been in this video 18 minutes, and I've already wiped! I wiped, guys! Wait, 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 there's still a chance! There's still... Nope! She dead! Well, it was worth a try, at least. I mean, I gave it my best. I hate two hill giguses. It's okay when there's one. It's okay, then. When there are two of them, it sucks. It sucks really bad. Look, Breath of Fire 3 is gonna be late anyway. We're going to go ahead and head back into the, uh, whatever. We're going to head back into the whatever. Oh, here we go. Stats. All right. Stats. Yes. Ah, uh, it doesn't say elemental affinities. None. Okay. 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 That's not what I want. Other info. Items dropped. I don't, it doesn't list. Oh, this sucks. It doesn't list what it's susceptible to. It has before, though, hasn't it? Has it not? Are you kidding? Is this a is this some kind of sick joke? All right. Cast Blink on yourself. I think Blink is more valuable than uh, Shield at this point. I don't know why I call it Shield. It's clearly Protect. Why do they always target the same one, too? Why is that? And why can Maria not land a single freaking... Oh. Okay, never mind. Um, she can never land a single attack. <clears throat> Shield yourself as well. If nothing else, I can bombard them with Fire 5 and miss my shield spell. 
It's okay, they're targeting Gus. That's good. All right, hit him with fire. Screw it, hit him with fire. Cast shield on yourself. As long as they're targeting you, we're set. Okay, there we go. He's shielded. He's blinked. Layla's gonna... Oh, it. they both didn't target Layla. Just one of them that time. Battle. First battle. No Gigas is easily put to sleep. Oh, really? Okay, and then it says, make sure to cast Blink and Protect. Well, no, duh. Sleep on both. Life on... Blink on her. Attack the back one. I was debating on reviving Therian, as you might have seen. How fortunate. Now she gonna die. Oh, she didn't die. He gonna die. What are the odds that sleep will never land? I really... She failed, okay. Good to know. That's good to know. I'm glad. <clears throat> I'm glad I now know she cannot get away from this fight. So I need to revive Firion. I need to immediately cast Blink on Firion. You don't know life, right? I didn't teach you life. No, okay. Try to put one of them to sleep. And you revive Firion. And maybe they'll target Layla and miss. Or Gus and Miss. Either would work for me, really? At this point? Ooh, don't attack Virian. Ooh, don't attack Virian. Yes! Yes! Victory! Defeat. Victory and defeat. Yes, put the party to sleep. Good plan, Maria. I'm glad you're on this. Better to blink Virian than to uh, heal him. Because if I heal him, they'll probably put out like 300 damage and completely negate the heal. But if I blink him, there's a chance he'll dodge everything they throw at him or they'll kill Layla instead. That works too, dadgummit. That's actually what I had planned all along, was that they'd just kill Layla. Now attack the back one. This is gonna work. This is... This is gonna work. <laughs> this is gonna work. This is gonna work, guys. 23 minutes in, this is gonna work. I am so glad I healed him. <laughs> Please go to sleep. Now the front one's awake. You keep attacking the back one. You keep healing Furion. This is, this is going to work, guys. I've done it before. It was only one heal gig it's then, but still, I've done it before. Why? Why do they keep waking up? Like, instantly. I mean, that time it wasn't instantly. It's not worth reviving her. Just kill the one in the back. With your big stick, apparently. Where was that? At? Oh, I've not been using it. That's where it was at. I find it disturbing that this website does not list um, its debuff weaknesses. Surely it does, and I'm just overlooking it, right? Classification? Location? Bestiary? Oh, I can check my bestiary. I bet that says it. Guys, did you know... That in this particular version of the game, if you go to config, you can go to collections, you can open the bestiary, you can... Weird. You can go to the bestiary, and <clears throat> you can come all the way down here to, uh... Yes, all the way down here. All the way down here, apparently, to Hill Gigas. You can click on it, and you can get all these details about it. 
Um, none of which are what I want. It does give us a weakness, but it doesn't have a weakness. <clears throat> that's too bad. Really, that's too bad. All right, all right, we're done. We're done with that. We're done with that, guys. We're done. Oh, we don't need to leave yet, though, because we have to. We have to heal. We already have to revive someone. We are one step into this cave, and we're having to revive. I miss having Gordon. Gordon had cure. Cure was invaluable. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this game anymore, guys. I like it. I'm 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 really starting to appreciate Final Fantasy 2 for what it is. The baby brother of the good Final Fantasy games. But that's okay. Everyone loves the baby brother. It's cute. It tries too hard. It's I frankly, the baby brother might be the best brother. Do you see that car drive by and flash its lights on my face? Did you see that one? I didn't. I wasn't watching my camera that time. I shouldn't be watching my camera anyway. I should either be looking at the webcam directly, but then you get this glare. Or I should be looking at my game. Which is what I'm doing most of the... This is a weird little grouping of enemies. <clears throat> Nothing particularly notable here. Guys. Let's cast Holy. Yeah, Holy! Diver! Ride the tiger! I don't know that song, guys. I <laughs> I know one part of that song. This is sad. But it's the part Jack Black sings in Tenacious D. When he says, ride the tiger, you can see his stripes, but you know he's clean. And then I'm fairly certain Dio says, ooh, don't you know what I mean. And beyond that, I don't know the song at all. Something about a midnight sea? Or is it Midnight Sun? You've been down too long in the Midnight Sea, right? Right? Oh, look, I know I know two lines of the song. Woo! That, that's how bad my musical knowledge is. You're welcome. You now, you now know how bad I am at music. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. That's a, uh, that's a The Rock song. Dwayne The Rock Johnson, he sung that song. He did it well, too. get Moana how do you not get it you mean you didn't watch Moana you didn't watch one of the greatest Disney films of all time ah, ah, new best Disney princess ah. so uh so Kingdom Hearts 3 is about to come out I, by the way I don't Ariel will always be best Disney princess you know what I mean that fish tail oh. um I need to move my mouse off of the uh, X button before I close this window and screw myself I was saying something. Maria's eight max HP and endurance went up, and Gus's magic defense. I grinded for like an hour and didn't get any bonuses on Maria. One fight with Shriekers. Oh, time to give her a bonus or two. Um, guys, so Kingdom Hearts three is coming out, right? Not immediately, obviously. It's still going to be in the works for another six years, but it's coming out, right? And uh, here's my thing. There have been a lot of princesses added since Kingdom Hearts 1. Well, not a lot, but, you know, you have Elsa and Moana, and, uh, I was gonna say... Is her name Meredith? Merida? Merida? Mer Mer Maritha? Meredith? The redhead from Brave. But she's not a Disney princess. She's a DreamWorks princess? Pixar princess. She's not technically Disney. Anyway... Um, or is she? Maybe she is. Rapunzel? Rapunzel's been added, of course. Um, so here's my question. Are we gonna restructure the Seven Princesses of Heart? Take, uh, take Alice out of that, maybe? Are we gonna make it the Nine Princesses of Heart? I mean, why not, really? Come on, Kingdom Hearts, you've already made up so much other crap. Just be like, ah, we miscounted, actually. There were nine. Our mistake. It can't be that bad, right? Right? I mean, you're, you're, you're Square Enix and Disney. You can't, you can't technically make a mistake. Everything's perfect.
Wow, Mage's Staff boosts his attack a lot. I was actually coming down here to look at the Wing Blade, which will also boost his attack a lot, but it'll get rid of Crescent. And given how consistently we're encountering um, yeah, let's go ahead and equip that on her. Given how consistently we're encountering Hill Gigases, Hill Gigai, Hill Gigas, Gigas, Hill Gigais, is this is Hill Gigases. Given how frequently we're encountering giants, clear the table. Considering how frequently we're encountering giants, I would like to be able to put things to sleep with my auto attacks. And that's a lot of ogre mages. I prefer they not get a chance to attack, so please kill them all immediately. Thank you. Come again. Is there going to be a boss fight at the end of this? I wonder. I ponder that. We are 31 minutes into this video, guys. I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Thanks so much for watching my video, guys. If you enjoyed it, be sure to leave a like and comment down below. If you didn't, leave a comment anyway. Let me know what I can improve on, and be certain to click my icon in the upper right to subscribe for more upcoming content. I upload multiple Let's Play videos daily. In fact, there's another one right there in the bottom left corner. For more on this series, be sure to check out the playlist in the bottom right corner. Have a great day. Thanks so much for watching my video.